What up, guys? This is Gas Mask Knitter One. Um, this is my first knitting video. I started knitting last night. Started making knitting videos tonight. I figured uh, I should give some pointers to new knitters out there because I am indeed a new knitter myself. My aunt Selma uh, taught me how to knit last night, even though she said that. She doesn't teach people how to knit, and her and her ladies that she knits with agree that they don't teach people how to knit because it's too frustrating. Uh, but as you know, and Selma has a sweet spot in her heart for the gas mask knitter, uh, and she taught me how to knit last night a little bit. I had to do a little supplemental learning on YouTube. But I've been knitting for about uh, two or three hours tonight. I practice a lot on just starting and restarting, because starting's the hardest part. Uh, and then once you get going, put on a Hue and Planet, or my son subscribes to the Science Channel, had a great expose on North American wildlife. So I turned on that. I grabbed my knitting needles uh, and the orange yarn that Selma has made. And I've been sitting here in this chair for a few hours now, knitting away, and it's even it's past my bedtime, but, but you know, if you're a knitter, then you'll know once you start, you can't stop. And if you're not a knitter, um, you have this to look forward to. It's really it's a captivating activity to do uh, by yourself or with your Aunt Selma um, or your Aunt Louise that will also knit with you. Um, Selma is actually out of her daughter's house today, tonight, so I have the house to myself, so I'm knitting uh, alone. And it's nice, it's therapeutic. You get to you sit here, you get to get lost in your own thoughts, get lost in the television. And uh, it's really, you know, it's a really nice way to spend the evening. Um, in fact, it kind of puts you in a, in a zen state. It really gets you ready for bed if you can ever pull yourself away from the activity of knitting. Anyway, this is my uh, first knitting video. So I just wanted to show you how far I've gotten. Uh, well, gas masks are getting in the way, but there you can see that this is like two halves. It'll be whole um, soon enough. And yeah, maybe about an inch long, uh, maybe an inch and a half of my five inch scarf. I'm knitting a scarf for a friend with a tiny neck. So it'll be done maybe tomorrow. I'm really excited. You know, he's going to love it. He always complains about how every scarf he gets. It's just a bit too big for him. Uh, but not this one. Um, my, five, my famous gas. Mm, Gas Mask Knitter's 5-inch, famous 5-inch scarf. Uh, I'll have it ready and I'll be sure to display it tomorrow uh, when I post another video, uh, hopefully of a finished product. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. Uh, pick, up, pick up your needles, pick up your yarn, make a scarf. Gas Mask Knitter signing out.